Hello, sir. You might think it is unusual for me to talk to you on the subway since that is very rare, especially here in New York. Not all. I've lived in New York a long time. Believe me, I've seen it all. In that case, I was wondering if you would help me with something. What's that? Do you need directions? No. I need to know more about a concept called CYPOC. Oh, CYPOC. That is a concept within Lean Six Sigma. It stands for suppliers, inputs, processes, outputs, and customers. Oh, is that what it stands for? When my boss first asked me to work on it, I thought it was a rare disease. We are in the biotech business, you know. Ah, interesting. In any case, CYPOC is used in the defined phase of a Lean Six Sigma project to initially understand the process better. How does it work? Well, first, identify and name the process to be mapped. For example, you might look at a process for manufacturing a diagnostic test for a disease. Second, we define the scope of the process. How far back up the supply chain will we go and how far downstream will we go? Right. Next, we name the outputs and their customers inside the outputs and customers boxes. Then, we name the suppliers and the inputs they provide in their respective boxes. We can next identify process enablers such as equipment. Then, we document customer requirements for the outputs if we already have them. And then we're done? Almost. The final step is draw or write in the process steps inside the process box. If drawn, processes should be drawn as a block diagram where each block is a major activity. Ah, uh, I get it now. I think I can make this work. Would you call it a high-level process map? Excellent. I would consider CYPOC to be a high-level process map. By the way, where did you learn about CYPOC? I learned it from my friends at EMS Consulting Group. www.emsstrategies.com EMS Consulting Group. www.emsstrategies.com Right. They have lots of online resources and offer training and advisory services. Do you have a pen so I can write that down? Unfortunately, not. But if you give me your email address, I'll send you a link. Great idea. Are you on Facebook? Maybe I should friend you. You're a smart guy.